So not a lot of people, you know, accomplish what you accomplished in the queue. What do you think? Why? Why? How, how do you think you did that? Uh, I think, you know, I was I was pretty pretty lucky in a lot of ways. Um, I, I never really had any injury adversity. Um, I, I never really had any big injuries. I never missed games for or any ex- extended periods of time. Um, and then I was lucky enough to play in the same place for five years, which is not very common um, in major junior. So I, I was really lucky enough to build so many strong relationships with, um, you know, my coach, Jim, um, the trainers, Kevin Spide, and, and really just everyone around the organization. And um, I think that just kind of allowed me to, I didn't have to worry about so many things and the outside. I could just show up to the rink, be comfortable every day and, and just kind of play my game. And it was like that year after year, I didn't have to worry about, you know, making new friends on the team or, yeah. you know, uh, finding where I'm going to be in the dressing room. Like I never really had to switch billets. So, um, you know, there's a lot of things in junior hockey that can create a lot of adversity that I was really lucky enough to not have to, to go through. But, um, and I think, you know, like I've, I was also on some pretty, some pretty great teams, uh, with a lot of great teammates. So I was, uh, definitely a very fortunate junior player I, I had yeah. a lot of good bounces for sure incredible that video there's a video of you on youtube i think it was the last game you were in the green jerseys or black jerseys and you got the standing O. like talk about that that's that's incredible yeah that was uh that was pretty cool it was a special moment um that was after they announced so it was in the third period when i set the minutes played record oh, was that okay yeah so um the after the whistle went after i set the record or whatever they announced that i um you know finally broke that record and um the fans all reacted that way so it was it was pretty special uh feeling you know playing there for so long and Sick. you put in so much time and effort and you know my teammates all came down and congratulated me in the net and yeah. uh you know even the other team was standing on the bench so who are you playing Cape Breton. Nice. That's cool. Yeah. The local team. Yeah, and I have a few buddies on that team. Yeah. So um it was it was a really special night. Uh the fans in Charlottetown were so good to me while I was there. Yeah. Um even on the even on the tough the tough games. I know I, I wasn't always uh very good in front of them, but <laughs> um, you know, even on the tough games they always stuck with me and they were always uh, always kept coming back. So my family was there, I got to enjoy it with them and uh, my billets as well so it was uh it was awesome something i'll never forget for sure yeah it's on it's cool that it's documented too we have it on video it's just yeah, on the internet like was there doing that game so it's yeah. uh it was uh yeah something i'll always be, have to look back on you're gonna have kids one day and they're not gonna believe you <laughs> like, oh, it's right here don't worry about it they show yeah, you exactly <laughs>